What was that, John? <laughs> I said, what have I gotten myself into? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I didn't know that Drew was on Jocelyn time. I, I am today, unfortunately, because I had to load all her Canada gear. So Joss is going to Canada. John and I are going to somewhere. I can't tell you. But we're going somewhere. And we're going to go dig fun stuff. Maybe I'll tell you later. We'll Sounds see. good. All right, we're going to get on the road. we got a five-hour drive, oh, and nice. we're going to go dig this afternoon. So we got to get moving. So we'll see you when we get there. Really? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Found some new friends. They're curious. Maybe not. Maybe not so curious. Hello, sheep. Ba ba black sheep. Have you any wool? <laughs> I got issues. Let's go have some fun. All right. Well, we made it. We are at our destination. It is Friday night. Um, we're not going to be able to get out and do any detecting tonight, but we did get an in, an in on a, a field and we're walking the field looking for arrowheads. Um, the corn is about two, three inches high, so we're able to walk in between the rows without interfering with them um, and we're good to go. As long as we don't step on the plants, no problem. So one of the things we're looking for here is we're looking for flint. And that's what this piece is here. This is just a much larger piece that never, nothing ever got done with it. Um, it looks like it may have had some pecking at some point. It could be uh, plow damage. Um, not quite sure. If I come across anything good or if I come across any flakes, I'll show you what the, what the flint looks like a little better. It's a black material. Um, so... But I'll show you if I come across something. If not, well, we'll move on tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be all detecting. But this is arrowhead searching tonight. And John's off in the distance. Out there looking. He's never looked for arrowheads before. This is his first time looking for an arrowhead in the field. And not detecting. We're going to find something. Alright, see you in a bit. Alright, so I got a piece of worked flint here. Um, it is, it, it's a flake basically, so they were close by napping tools. So that's a start, that's the first really good thing I found, it's the first related item. And uh, how are you doing there John? Alright. What do you got there, you got a pokey stick? I, I do have a pokey stick. John, John is going to tell you from his immense amount of experience on his first trip, you need a pokey stick for your arrowheads. That's right. So you don't have to bend over as much. <laughs> just, All right. You just flip it over. So, that's it so far. Just one little piece of remnant of flake for now. So, alright. On to the next. Yes, John. Can I touch your pokey stick? Yes. Thank you. I'm going to point with the pokey stick. Down here, there is a piece of flint sticking out. Alright, now... That flat side has been napped off of something bigger, which tells me that that could have been worked on the other side. So what we're going to do is we're going to see, sometimes the flakes are tools. And that one is, without a doubt, a flake knife. And this would have been used for scraping sinew or tendons. Um, it might have been used for uh, cutting away in tight spaces on a hide. Um, this is this is this is great. This could have been for uh, since we're on a on a waterway. Um, this could have been used for skinning a fish. Scaling. Or scaling a fish. Um, this is this is great. This is this is phenomenal. This is. Um, I mean, yeah, I'm happy with that. It just to some of you, it might look like a flake of flint. But really, you, you have to visualize that they used everything that they, they touched um, to, the, to, to the most extreme point that they could. 
So a lot of this stuff is not waste. It, it might have been, they might have been working on a bigger piece, but they have scraps and they will work with the scraps. What do you think, John? I think it's definitely worked. That's awesome. Oh, it's without a doubt. It's so. got that beautiful... It edge. has a patina to it, it does. from being in the ground. That is awesome, dude. I'm happy with that. Like, if I don't find anything else all night, I'm good. <laughs> Just but, we got, <laughs> but you know what? John needs to get on the board, and we need to find something before we check into the hotel for the night. And uh, I will catch you on the next one. This is super cool. I'm, I'm very happy with that. All right, see you in a bit. I think I got my first flake. I think you got your first flake? Yeah, I think so. Or are you just a flake? Uh, I don't know. Show me, show okay, me, show me, show me, show me. No. It's coal. Is it really? It's coal. <laughs> I've been a bad don't, boy. <laughs> <laughs> don't beat me. Don't beat me. It's coal. Oh, man. Let's go see if we can say hello to oh, the Oh, it bird. is coal. What the? See? The little birdie? Yes. Where uh, is the... Where okay. is the... Little feller. He's gonna start yelling at you. Here. Yes, I'd like to get yelled at. I hear you. I hear you, but I don't see you. Is she crouched down? Yeah, she is now. Now I don't see her. Careful, because you don't want to step on her. No, 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 no. I don't want. I'm not gonna hurt her. I hear her. Literally right in front of us somewhere. Somewhere, yeah. She is so well camouflaged. And that's really amazing. It is. That's Where is she? I mean, and I hear the little peeps. Careful, man. I hear. Where are you? She just flew away. Did she? Oh, no. There she is. There she is. Okay, now you got her. I see her. Oh, wow. she's beautiful. Let me see if I can zoom in on her. I'm not going to mess with her. No way. It's kind of grainy when you zoom in, but. She'll leave you alone, Mama Bird. Yeah. Have fun sitting on your nest. That was really cool. See you, Mama Bird. Ooh, that's pretty pottery. Thick. Nice, really thick. Thick piece of stoneware with a heavy, heavy blue glaze on it. Man, that would have been... Oh, oh I can just imagine what that piece of pottery would have looked like. Amazing. Oh, so sad. But you know what? One piece is cool. You could probably put that in like a mosaic or something. Yeah, cool. Find so some more. Is this is this a Indian artifact? No. Okay. No, I'm still that's, trying. No, that's just settler colonial something remnants. So, all right, back to the field. Let's find some more. All right. Well, we are back in the car, John and I, and we are off to the hotel. We're gonna go get checked in. Uh, get cleaned up, go maybe find a frosty adult beverage somewhere, and uh, kick back and relax till tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be a really long day. We're going to have some fun. Absolutely. Treasure hunting. Good start tonight, so I'm happy. All right, well, we will catch you in the a.m., bright and early, and with some treasures in hand, hopefully. See you then. Later. The one thing that I drove all the way back up here to find. One thing. That's all I wanted. I didn't get one on the last trip. DJ got, I think, at least two, maybe. One thing. Let's take a look. Sit, Julie, sit. Good, Julie.